Hey guys, so I did an unboxing a while back for this company when they sent me out stuff. And they sent me out six oils. Um, I have been behind on stuff. I do apologize for this. So this right here is going to be kind of a more in-depth first impression video. Because uh, I do have six oils. So when I do this video, when this video goes up, is when I will start using them. Now, with it being six different scents, six different oils, it's going to take me a few weeks, and I will get the other video up. But, here I am talking about them. This company is out of Louisiana. Great owner. Great scents. Love all the scents. Loved them when I opened them. Who I'm talking about is Mudcat Whiskers. So, this is the Bayou Black. This is Amber, Lavender, and Vanilla. Now, I love the labels on here. You know, being from New Orleans, or not New Orleans, but from Louisiana. You know, you've got that old world feel to it. I love that. Vinyl label. Yes, he does do retail. It's awesome. So, the ingredients. I'm thinking they're going to be across all the same across all the oils. So, I'm just going to read them once. That's what you're going to get. So, the ingredients are Jehovah, hemp seed, argon, vitamin E, blended with essential oils and fragrance oils. That's it. Simple. Simple works. You know, I've always heard this, the term, keep it simple, stupid. If it works, it works. Keep it simple, and it'll work. But again, this one is the Bayou Black. This is amber, vanilla, and lavender. Love an amber scent, love vanilla. I don't know how about with them with the lavender, but it does work. It's a really nice scent. Now it is darker in the color, you know, but we're all kind of used to that color right there. You get about three fourths to a full dropper. So, with this being a lighter weight oil, that's all you would need. You wouldn't need much more than that. Well, that's the Bayou Black. Now this next one is Eveline. Now this is just a rich, warm, masculine scent. Eveline. I get my camera to focus. Come on. Yeah. Love the vinyl labels on there again. And of course the ingredients are the same, like I said. It's a real lighter scent. Let me get a little bit. Let me get just a little bit on the hand. Kind of rub it in a little bit. Maybe kind of warm it up. Let's see how it's going to smell. Yeah, that's just a real light. It is a it is a like a warmer scent, but it's a real lighter scent. Now this next one is Zydeco. Which is sesame, sesamo, or sesamo, I don't know how you say it, and cayenne. That's a really nice scent. It's got a little spice to it. I like that. Again, same kind of color, about three fourths of a dropper. You gotta love when you get three fourths of a dropper. You gotta love that. Three down, three to go. This next one is Pawpaw's Pipe. Now, Pawpaw's Pipe was a dark cherry pipe tobacco. I love cherry tobacco, love the scent. I have a couple other ones, love that scent. And this is no different. You smell it, you get the cherry and the like, and then like just all of a sudden there's the, the tobacco, the pipe tobacco. If you like the scent of pipe tobacco, which I do, growing up around my dad when I was younger, he smoked a pipe for a while. My uncle smoked a pipe. I always loved that scent. It's just it kind of brings back childhood memories, you know, just that that pipes, that pipe tobacco scent. If you like pipe tobacco, you'll like this scent. 
That is so good. It just it reminds me of like walking in the house, like you know, just walking in the house, knowing my dad just either put laid it up or he just put it out, and just that scent is in the air. I always like the scent of pipes, of pipe tobacco. They're just always just been a great scent. I've always liked them, so that one I do like. So we got two left. Now this one is John Lafitte. If you don't know who John Lafitte is, he's a, he was a pirate in, from Louisiana. Now this is his take on a Bay Rum scent. Same color, so everything is, you know, it's all consistent across the board. Same color of the oil, about three-fourths of a dropper. I love that. I love seeing that. I don't like when I'm using or I get like four or five different oils from a company and it's like they're all like a different shade of yellow or they're different in color or a different consistency. It's like, eh, you know, I, I like to see just the same across the board. The scent profiles just need to be different. But the oils, I think, just need to be a, a, the, across the board, just need to be the same. This is one thing with Mudcat Whiskers. It's going to be the same all across the board. I do like that. And this is the Bay Rum scent. I do have quite a few Bay Rum scents. So this is the scent so far I really do like out of the bottle. I do like that. That is really nice. Now, the last one is Traitor. I know it's all French, or it's all that French Cajun, and I can't really speak French Cajun. I'm more Texan than anything. But now, this one is more, a little more complicated. This is Vevertier, Citrus, Bergamot, White Tea, Sea Salt, and Green Lily. Like I said, it's a little more complicated. So you don't get like the, all the different notes of the oil, which I do like that too. Shake it up really good. Make sure you get it. Again, oil, same color, same on the dropper. Now you get, you get like the, the like the sea salt and like the green lily, all that kind of up front like a little bit of like the tea I'm a, I'm a sweet tea person not a white tea person <laughs> well, gotta stay hydrated gotta stay awake all right that is really nice i do get like a little bit of the, the citrus and white tea all that kind of mixing all together. So I guess when you get it in beard, it's really gonna to come to life and everything's gonna hit you at different points. I love oils like that. When you, you know, you smell them out of the bottle and you kind of get some of the stuff, but then you, it's like you get it in the beard, it kind of gets heated up in your hands, you put it on, get it down to your skin as always. Don't ever just put oil on your beard, always get it down to the skin you know, depending on what you're doing for the day, you might get a little warm, get a little hot, and it's just like, you know, that just stuff, just them scents just come, start coming at you. I love that. I think this is going to be one of them. Uh, I love the label on that one. The clock. Gotta love it. That was the six oils that I got. I have a discount code. It's BEAST2020. I believe you saved 20%. So, Mudcat Whiskers, this is the Bayou Black. This is a really nice scent. This was the Amber, Vanilla, and Lavender. So, guys, Beef 2020, save yourself 20%. Go check them out. Link will be down below. Check them out. See if there's anything you like. He has a lot of different scents. I've checked them out. A lot of different stuff. Check them out. See what you like. And as always, keep the beer game strong.
for me and Mudcat. We'll holler at y'all later.